Hello, it's Estrella with a reading for the collective. Take what resonates and throw out the rest. We'll check in and see what karmic energy is planning and doing, doing and planning. Because I saw that Knight of Swords in one spread and then Devil and I forget what it was in the intentions position um, of a water sign reading that I haven't posted yet. So let's see here. What is, what is this karmic energy planning? What's going on right now? What do we need to be aware of? What does the collective need to know in regards to this karmic energy? Nine of Wands, Ace of Swords. So somebody is definitely being, I would say the truth has come out about something that they've done over and over and over again, either to cause unhappiness. They were very smug about it, um, very materialistic and smug. Uh, it was a dream, not be careful what you ask for situation. So that is out. They feel like everyone's walking away from them or that they should be walking away um, from the situation. But I don't think that's what they're doing because I saw nine of Knight of Swords in a previous reading. In the recent past, the King of Cups um, maybe they tried to start again with this King of Cups or there was another King of Cups or this King of Cups is a Divine Masculine that found self-love. We'll get clarification for that. They want to move towards this Hierophant. They're planning on going towards a Hierophant or marriage or some sort of traditional uh, organization. We've got Seven of Swords underneath, so there's some sort of sneaking line going on here. We have Six of Pentacles in the near future, so someone giving or getting money or um, so, some sort of power dynamic playing out here. That could be what the lie is in the near future. Okay, right. Devil and Death. I mean, that is like fatal attraction, right? That's the lens that they're looking through. That is so... Oh, I remember the cards up here in the other reading I saw was... Was it Five of Swords and Devil? Or... Yeah, it was Five of Swords and Devil. And I got that in a previous reading as well. So it feels like an obsession with an ending. An obsession with ending something or an extremely dark obsession, an addiction, a win at all costs energy. Uh, I will get some clarification. That's how they're looking at this. This is like an obsessed and upset, uh, just toxic rage even. Un out of control, it feels like. Page of discs. Someone making an um, offer or investment with someone in the environment or some evidence. Afraid of moon victory. Or wanting a deceptive victory. Wanting to appear on top. Deceit, lies, maybe how they got to where they're they're at, all the deceit and lies coming to light. Outcome is chariot and judgment, so... Oh, sorry, world. World card. So, the end of a cycle with trying to get control of the environment. So, if this is going to hit a peak at some point and be done. There's something about someone who's very independent 
or this idea of being independent and something someone has been building on their own. It's got an image of some somebody sitting there trying to build a sand castle and enjoy themselves and someone just wanting to smack it out of their hands. <laughs> That's what I, I saw. So it's kind of that energy when looking at this, this nine of pentacles and right underneath it is this page of swords. So very like a watchful eye could be gossip as well. So it seems like there's some ending happening. Um, let's use these. The dream didn't come true. The dream. Let's see, nine of cups. Nine of cups. This offer. Someone doesn't want to be involved anymore. They want to get out of the nightmare. Careful what you ask for. Someone didn't become the emperor that they wanted to be. That's the truth. They feel, and this, it's the truth about this, like, someone was trying to hang in there, or this person's trying to hang in there with this, um, they don't want to let go. There's maybe communication. Two of Cups reversed. They don't care if it's not this, like, I idyllic, thing they don't want to let go okay queen of um pentacles seven of wands someone's walking away they feel like they're gonna have to defend themselves i don't know there's like Okay, what's driving them is that they're feeling like lies are going to get exposed. But I feel like lies are already exposed. Maybe I'm reading that wrong. What else is this in the subconscious? They've kept everyone on the fence. They've kept this. They're trying to keep a stalemate going. They don't want someone to walk away. I don't know what that is yet. I'll come back. Wow. Okay. Yeah. There was some justice in the recent past with this King of Cups. Uh, having to do with this King of Cups and Queen of Cups. Could be something that came to light. But there was justice. Something that played out in the universe. Having to do with a King and Queen of Cups. This person... doesn't want this person to become unstuck and get what's fair. They don't want to let go of the money. They don't want to let go of the, they don't, yeah, they don't want this person to get clarity and There's a power imbalance that they don't want to let go of. The six of, so that's six of pentacles reverse, and then the six of pentacles upright in the near future has to do with this two of pentacles reverse feeling really, this could be money, um, someone, someone losing money, being very imbalanced, really, really trying though to get this Ten of Cups. Someone taking action. Someone making a final choice. Someone has a broken heart. So, someone trying to do what's fair, but it throws somebody else off. Tell me about this devil and death. It's, it's like, if no one, no one, if I can't have you, no one can, almost. Son. Obsession. Their obsession is very 
it's coming to the surface more than it than it has in the past because of the way that they're seeing things they don't probably realize how they come across their jealousy of this nine of pentacles person it's all kind of like someone wants to walk away of this from this corruption this gossip and these lies they know that but what they're not aware of is how they're coming across this kindergarten teacher in this deck it's called kindergarten teacher um, page of pentacles what's going on with that <laughs> page of pentacles is clarified by page of pentacles well we've got the empress there so someone wants to give something make an offer to the empress or there's some sort of evidence about about what's going on in regards to this empress magician that's the moon and also three of pentacles somebody wants to build somebody something's manifest someone's manifesting something with this group they're doing it maybe in secret this person could be afraid that the wheels are already turning in the divine feminine's favor or they want to continue doing something in secret that makes it hard for this divine feminine page of cups someone's going to say they're sorry in the end to someone and that's why the cycle is over yeah this high priestess someone's going to apologize to the high priestess so right now this person is experiencing a tower moment um about this nine of pentacles person that they've been watching and gossiping about and trying to keep just weighed down a lot like make it very hard for this person to get past anything to to make it to make it at all um so that is where this person is at this is a ending of something definitely an ending someone does not want to be part of it anymore it seems like there was justice and judgment already in the recent past so it's strange that they're still trying this person isn't really wanting to let go i guess that's this devil and death they don't want to let go of this divine feminine what they're doing either um so i'm just gonna get a few more cards to understand what their intentions are here with this hierophant What is going on with this Hierophant Six of Coins reversed? Eight of Swords reversed Scarcity Tactics. Hmm. Right. Okay, six of coins reversed. Like, planning on taking everything. Hierophant, taking everything. Unfair power balance. It almost feels like... unbothered someone might be unbothered about that family issues hmm. this could be threatening like if there's children it could be threatening anything that this masculine energy cares about like trying to um, threaten blackmail with money, things, um, any, if there's like a position, confuse, create confusion, right, to create confusion with the divine feminine, the divine masculine as well, yeah, oops, threatening, that's this like 
any, it's just a lot of threats, threats with death and the devil. Yeah. And like I said, any kind of stuff with children. So they're planning on, yeah, all of their bad habits that they had before are just increasing. Um, what happens with this? They're going to get rejected though. Whatever it is that they're trying to do in the near future, there's going to be some heart heartbreak. Someone's going to be very happy. Someone's going to get control and then someone else is going to get rejected. Whatever they're hustling for or whatever lies they told, their head is in the clouds trying to get whatever jackpot this is. Yeah, their ego is going to be bruised. They're going to go bankrupt. They might end up with some legal um, issues from all of this. And in the recent past, this Queen of Cups and King of Cups, please. Running, yeah, this uh, Divine Masculine might have done this in a very um, congenial way where this person didn't realize what exactly was happening when they left. But now they're figuring it out. They're figuring it out. There could have been some a lot of planning with this. That's what I think, that someone found something out. This person doesn't know everything that this masculine knows. That's what I'm getting. Because I'm not seeing that they know. Wow. This is for them. It's really about just status and money. Um, so moon victory, they still are trying to find ways of bringing down this divine feminine, which now at this point, yeah, they can't stand the idea of the feminine getting anything they have to be victor victorious and but this is because this is the lens they're looking through it means that's their vantage point that's where they're communicating from they're they're saying words that we've got ace of swords reversed and doing things page of swords reversed that are very, very toxic, and it's very vis visible to whoever they are communicating with or are around. And I think people aren't letting this person in on exactly the extent of what's happening, um, which I think makes sense. Um, I know there's like a lot of arguing and things going on around the divine masculine. This person might be kept in the dark a little bit because of the fact that this person is looking at things like devil and death, which is like a very, you know, an intending bad stuff, like su super obsessed and looking everyone up and all of that stuff. So um, it looks like they're gonna get caught up pretty pretty soon with an e bruised ego. Um, all right, I hope that helps, bye.